Hello everyone. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, where I review various products I use every day. Today, we're embarking on a journey to the world of bedroom furniture, focusing our attention on the ever-popular IKEA Malm bed, its accompanying nightstands, and the cozy Hovag mattress. So grab a cup of tea, settle in, and let's explore these pieces together. Let's kick things off with a discussion about the Malm bed. Picture this. A sleek, modern bed frame finished in pristine white, complete with a Leroy base and four generously sized drawers for plenty of storage. Now, full disclosure, I didn't personally purchase this bed. It came with the furnished apartment I'm renting for the past two years. Over the past couple of years, it's been my go-to spot for catching some sleep and relaxing. Here's the scoop. Those drawers are incredibly handy for tucking away extra linens, clothing, or whatever else you need to keep out of sight. However, I've noticed they tend to accumulate more dust than anticipated, despite being closed most of the time. As for the noise factor, well, let's just say it's a tad more creaky than I had initially imagined. Also, a slight shift in position from one sleeper is enough to send ripples across the entire bed, potentially disturbing the other person. On the other hand, when sleeping alone, it is pretty comfortable. It's hard to pinpoint whether these troubles originate from the bed, the mattress, or a combination of both. In terms of materials, the wood is undeniably sturdy, but it does tend to emit a bit of noise, particularly if someone accidentally bumps against the headboard during the night. Personally, I lean toward upholstered beds for their quieter, softer feel. But hey, the Malm has its perks too, like less dust and fewer dust mites hiding inside. Plus, the headboard is a winner for those late-night reading or movie-watching sessions, providing ample support and comfort. However, with prolonged use, I've noticed a bit of wobbliness developing in the headboard. Overall, while this particular bed in my apartment is white, it's worth noting that the Malm is available in various colors and features a minimalist design that complements a wide range of bedroom styles and decor themes. Moving on to the nightstands, which are part of the same Malm collection as the bed. These little sidekicks have been reliable companions, always within arm's reach when needed. Each nightstand features two good-sized drawers, perfect for stashing away bedtime essentials and much more. But here's the catch. The back edges of these nightstands can be a bit prickly. Yep, they're like tiny daggers waiting to surprise you in your sleep. Ouch! Ikea, smooth those edges out, and the nightstands will be perfect. On the bright side, these nightstands seamlessly blend into any room style and are available in a variety of colors to suit individual preferences. Now, let's turn our attention to the Hovag mattress that came with the bed when we moved in. With 24 centimeters height, this mattress promises a comfortable night's sleep, which is true when one person is sleeping on it. But when two people are sleeping on it, one person's movement can cause the other to wake up. As I said before, I don't know if this is the matter of mattress, the bed, or both, because I had them combined from the first day of moving in. One more downside, the mattress cover isn't removable for washing, which can be a bit troublesome. Over time, the accumulation of dead skin cells, sweat, body oils, and other debris creates an environment ripe for dust mites and allergens to thrive. And there you have it the comprehensive rundown on the Malm bed, its accompanying nightstands, and the Hovag mattress. Remember, every piece of furniture comes with its own set of quirks, but it's all about finding what works best for your individual needs and preferences. Until next time, take care and stay cozy. Bye-bye.